Hello folks and welcome to this video. We are in X-Plane version 10.36 and we are situated at beautiful Innsbruck, Austria. In this short tutorial I am going to show you how you can fix the ILS alignment issue uh, which is very very annoying um, when uh, when you're basically approaching final on the runway and you s your, your glide slope shows that you're perfectly aligned on the runway but you actually are not and you probably would end up landing on the grass uh, if you continue your uh, your approach. Um, and I did a little bit of research um, and I found out the, uh, the solution to this problem so I wanted to share it with you and it's rather simple uh, but the caveat here is that um, every time you update your nav database uh, you probably need to go and fix those alignments again. Um, I haven't done Innsbruck before, I've just installed a new scenery uh, from explain.org so um, let's go ahead and see uh, if the problem's there, if not then we can probably go to another airport uh, so the first thing you need to go is to go to location and then you go to the local map. Now once you go to the local map, zoom in to the airport of interest or the one that you're having issues with and as you can see the ILS is not aligned with the runway. This is, this is the runway at Innsbruck, okay? So this is your runway and this is where you see this line here in the center. That line should actually be at the, s the center of the runway. And, and that will basically achieve the uh, perfect alignment for your glide slope. So the way to fix this is to click on edit here. And then you go to the latitude. And you just simply click change this number until you have perfect alignment with the runway. That's it. That's all that there is to it. So you can see now if you intercept the ILS um, your, once your glide slope is activated you will be perfectly aligned to this runway uh, right here. Okay? So that is all for now and hopefully I'll be doing more tutorials uh, for X-Plane. Uh, a lot of people have been asking for uh, more videos on X-Plane. So I thought that was, this was a good start um, as I've never actually made uh, tutorials before. So I hope that you find this useful and it fixes your problem and I hope that you've also enjoyed this short tutorial as much as I enjoyed making it for you. Until next time, take care of yourselves and each other, and bye-bye for now.